Welcome back to another Pokemon opening. I want a turtle here and we are going to be opening up some more Sword and Shield packs. I think this time we're going to try something different, trying to tweak with how long the videos are. So I'm only going to open half the box and we're going to, I think we're going to skip the commons. The, a lot of the cards that we're interested from this set are either the rare slot, obviously, and, ooh, and the uncommon slot. That's where all the good supporters are and stuff like that, or like the good trainers. So we're going to skip the commons. I don't think there's much in the commons that we really care about. And we'll see how this goes, see how long the video is. And yeah, today is going to be another giveaway episode. We are doing giveaways throughout the month of February. And yeah, I can. as I'm recording this, the lighting is going crazy for the face cam. So if there's no face cam, that is why. Well, let's get into our first pack. So stuff that we are hunting for is... Actually, we've checked most of the boxes off. Uh, obviously, we still want some more Zacians, as the card's really good for some standard decks. And let's see what else. All right, so let's, um, okay, we'll just kind of skip through. Oh wait, all right. So I think the thing we need to do is pull the four, and then kind of like that. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Cramorant and Toxicroak. This reverse looks pretty cool. Then we have these. Oh yeah, so Pokemon Lady Seeking and Hitmonchan. We're looking for things like Pokemon Catcher, Quick Ball, Evolutionary Incense from the Uncommons. But yeah, I think those were the secret rares I'm also looking for. Alright, so let's see. If we take the first four, so we'll take the additional two, and then all the Uncommons will be at the back. So Salazzle, B-Sharp, Pokemon Catcher, there we go. Knocked out. Man, these... These reverses, I feel like they're a lot more glossy than I remember. And then a Musharna. And then these are all the commons. Alright, I think we got that right. So yeah, we're going to do another giveaway this week. And once again, we're going to do a giveaway for a your choice of ETB. Assuming, actually depending on where you are, I might have to purchase it online and have it shipped to you. And if that is the case, let's see, let's do this again. And if that is the case, sometimes they don't allow you to pick, but most likely, assuming that I can <laughs> opt for the one you want, it will try to be choice. Ooh, okay, our first ultra rare is a Lapras V. You know, I feel like there is some momentum with Lapras V Max, but Lapras V I just don't think is that good. Attach a water energy from your hand to this Pokemon if you do, switch it. Right, I guess and then 210 but this part really throws me off put two energy attached to this Pokemon back into your hand I'm not sure why you'd want to do that but Hey, we'll take it as a ultra rare and Lapras is one of the more popular ones But yeah in order to enter this giveaway for a ETB of sword and shield As always just make sure you are subscribed like the video and Leave a comment down below with the hashtag we're gonna go with Turtle Gang, shoutouts to Poco Dad. If you haven't checked out his channel, please do. He kind of tossed that in a comment one day. It's like, oh, I like that. So I think we're gonna we're gonna roll with that for a little bit. So hashtag Turtle Gang in a comment. We got a Drapion. What does this do again? Uh, AD Paralyze and then Poison. Not that good. And these are the uncommons. Yeah. So we're trying out this new opening format. Again, trying to fiddle with the time. I don't like it when videos go closer to like. 20 minutes long from opening so many packs so maybe this will speed things up and we'll see about just checking out the uncommons and skipping the commons we got a cool fish pokey kid actually this is a pretty good card energy search Ooh, reverse switch i actually like that and then a center scorch uh i think i've seen some mill decks i can't remember if they're around center scorch or not versus something else but a couple people have been mentioning to me that they want to try Scent to Scorch out. I do feel like it's a little too fragile. Like you can get off your big mill attack, but unless you end the match right there, it's not going to do enough. Alright, let's see. Citrus Berry, Corvus Squire, The Wacky. Ooh, Reverse Catcher. I like that. And then the Shady Deals Intellion. Actually, just gonna switch these piles. All right, we'll keep going. So, hope everyone had a, a good weekend. Apologies, there hasn't been a couple videos in a couple days. I uh, just took some time to uh, spend some with on 
some personal things. All right, so now these are over here. Aurora Energy is pretty good. I'm actually surprised that that card's being used. Raichu, that is very vanilla. And then Silicabra. And yeah, actually had a long weekend, so it was nice. And as Monday is, for hopefully everyone that's in the US was able to get the day off. Make a nice short week coming up. Crushing Hammer, not bad. Kingler Hyper Potion. Ah, this card just feels pretty bad. 120 damage to heal is not a whole lot. And then to discard two energy feels like a tall, uh, tall price to pay. Let's see, I messed up my piles. All right, Wooloo, very cute. And Sable IV. I feel like this card's so strong. We are about to build, to build our expanded deck, our Turbo Dark deck. I wonder if there's space for that in Sable IV. Uh, sometimes you do attack and you don't get the knockout. And then Sable IV feels like a great way to finish things off. Although I'm not sure because I wonder if you should just be kind of like positioning yourself for that one hit knockout. And Sable IV is kind of like a two step process, which maybe is just not the ideal way to go about it. Raboot. Ooh, wow, Chinchino, make do Chinchino reverse. I like it. And then a wild, okay, we're getting some pretty good Vs. Like the wild fed is also a very interesting card. Haven't seen that used too much in standard yet, but it's very cool. All right, let's see, Hitmonlee, Rare Candy, nice, Lucky Egg, and then a Reverse Bow Toy, and then a Whimsicott. All right, so no like texture cards so far, no full arts, no old uh, secret rares or anything like that. Man, if we don't find them here, that just means our next opening uh, later in the week will be absolutely amazing. And let me know what you think about this new opening format. Again, I feel like right now we're about seven minutes, 30 seconds. And it probably that's about the right, you know, getting close to that 10 minute mark. Coolfish, right to reverse, and then a Dreadnought. But yeah, I feel like we've done really well for Sword and Shield. And, you know, part of me was thinking maybe I should slow down, which we still might do. Uh, but when it comes to doing trading IRL, which I do do, do at League. Obviously, these cards are very popular. Ooh, Galarian Obstagoon Reverse. That's another good one. Should put this up here. And Oranguru. A lot of people were running Oranguru just as a way to play with additional card at your disposal, which is the card at the top of your deck. And maybe that's something we want to mix in there. For my current fire list, I feel like bench space is kind of a commodity, so or is a resource. So I'm not sure if it makes sense. But we might give it a try. Vitality Band's another interesting one. Haunter, Thwacky, a Krabby Reverse, then the Galarian Rapidash. Still have about five packs. But yeah, reminder if you do want to enter to win that ETB, make sure you're subbed, thumbs up, and leave a comment. Hashtag Turtle Gang. And yeah, I kind of like that phrase. Maybe we'll continue with that. Maybe we'll have to create a new Twitch emote with that at some point. And Corviknight. So far we did get three Ultra Rares, which, you know, for half a box wouldn't be too bad, but it will mean that we still have to find a couple full arts and hopefully a Secret Rare in the rest of the box so kind of hoping for at least one more hit so we don't put too much pressure on that second half of the box and then a cloister all right then we have something here judging by the side of the pack sudowoodo hop dotler Pharaoh Seed, ah, right, another Lapras VMAX. So we got the Lapras and the VMAX. That's a pretty good 
half of a box. Yeah, I think there's people still seem to feel like there's some potential with this Lapras V Max with G Max Pump, especially with Frost Moth. Just hey, like out of nowhere, deal a ton of damage with this. Although at its base, with assuming you have all water and energy, it is what 180. Actually, 180 80 for three energy. That is quite. That's quite strong. Okay, four hits out of the first half of the box. I like that ratio. I'm gonna get one full art and no hyper rare. Great ball, Galarian Lanoon, Rotom Bike, and then a Belt Toy is a reverse, followed by a Durant. Alright, guys, last pack. But yeah, make sure you are entered the giveaway. Again, sub, like, and hashtag Turtle, Ge Turtle Gang. <laughs> Almost messed it up. All right, let's see how we do. Haunter, Vitality Band, Raboots, oh, cute little snom. Then we have, oh, nice, Ordinary Rod, Hyper, uh, Secret Rare. So we probably did, this is probably our Secret Rare for the box. Uh, I think it's okay centered. I think it's a little top to bottom, not correct, but actually I do like this card. Um, I feel like it's a one of in if, if you're using it at all, but I'm really happy to pull that golden one. But uh, yeah, so we still have a couple left on our hit list like Quick Ball and uh, Professor's Research. Oh man, we're super low on Professor's Research. We need to start pulling some of those soon. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you entered the giveaway. And I'm Juan Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.